Hi, I'm Thomas Liu, Senior Gameplay Engineer on Volta X. Hi, I'm Christian Thompson, Senior Animator and Art Manager on Volta X. Today we're going to talk about the core gameplay of Volta X and how you and your crew will put their skills to the test in the World Volta Association. As we've shown in our other developer diaries, Volta X revolves around you and a crew of colorful characters piloting Voltas, powerful robots from a bygone era of conflict. In the current world, Voltas are the central pieces of the most popular sport in the world. One of the key things that makes Volta X special is that you'll control your crew inside of the Volta instead of the robot itself. Because of that feature, we've made sure that each member of your crew has unique characteristics that makes choosing who you bring into battle an important decision. To make it easier to understand how different pilots can help you, we've color-coded them. Crew dressed in red are melee crew. They're good at powering up any melee weapons. Crew dressed in blue are artillery crew. They're good at powering up any ranged weapons. Finally, crew dressed in yellow are repair crew. They're the best at putting out fires and repairing. You might think having repair crew on board might not be as valuable, but they have some of the most amazing abilities to keep Voltas and parts alive. Keeping your Volta alive is super important. Not only is this a win condition, we created our customization system so that players can tweak every aspect of the robot. We really want the player to feel that whatever robot they bring in a battle, it feels like it's yours. Each Volta has a unique mechanic to it, whether it's an extra weapon slot, additional arms, flight capabilities, or its powerful special ability. It's important to take all this into consideration as you're customizing your weapon loadouts and crew composition. The right combination of Volta, weapon, and crew can mean the difference between victory and defeat. You'll definitely want to take a moment to read the parts and crew member abilities. Knowing what to build towards and how your chosen Volta will interact with the enemy can really help you build your team to be the best that they can be. In the beginning, your options might be slightly limited. But quickly, you'll learn that having an extra punch arm or drill can really edge out a victory. Sometimes, taking a shield to mitigate damage is the best option to hold back the flurry of attacks. Getting that Volta build just right is important, as each bout is only one three minute round. You can win a battle in three different ways. Destroying your opponent's head, demolish your opponent's weaponry, and disabling your opponent's crew. Destroying the head is an instant win and is worth 50 points, but it can be difficult if your opponent knows what you're up to. You'll earn 1 point for every room demolished and 2 points for every crew member you disable. The team with the most points when time is up is the victor. Winning will earn you credits and gear to further develop your Voltas, and perhaps help you recruit additional crew members. You'll also gain experience whether you win or lose. All of these battles can take place in a single player store against AI opponents or in our PvP arena. We'll even have crossplay and clan support, so you can practice with your friends too. We plan to support PvP with new events, story, characters, and weapons post-launch, so there will always be a reason to keep strategizing and improving. We'll continue to share more about Volta X as we get closer to release in the summer of 2020. Thank you for watching.